Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching more details. General Hospital Spoilers, Jason slams Sunny for Mean Streak finally fights back over Carly. General Hospital GH Spoilers reveal that Jason Morgan Steve Burton will make a daring move during the week of April 22nd to 26th. So far, Jason has remained calm in his confrontations with Sonny Corinthos Maurice Bennard and has tried to explain as best as he can. Of course, Sonny knows Jason was working with the FBI and let everyone believe he was deceased, so he considers him to be a traitor. Since Sonny isnt getting the proper medication dose and is becoming quite paranoid, he s even raised the possibility that Carly Spencer Laura Wright might v e been in on Jason s secret all along. Although Jason doesn't t usually throw temper tantrums like Sonny, he admitted to Carly that he had a breaking point and was getting dangerously close to it. It looks like Sonny will finally push Jason too far soon enough. On April 25th, GH spoilers say Jason will corner Sonny for a face-off and slam him for his mean streak. After Sonny gets downright nasty to Carly Spencer Laura Wright, that may prompt Jason to stand up for her. Jason 1TC Why Sonny should care that Nina Corinthos Cynthia Watros sold him Carly S half of the Metro Court back nor will he see why Sonny should care that Carly S back in charge. If anything, Jason may argue that Sonny should be happy for his former wife since he knows how much Carly missed running the hotel with Olivia Cordemain Lisa Lo Cicero. Since Sonny S got a problem with all this, Jason may accuse him of being unnecessarily spiteful. Although Jason vowed to stay out of Sonny S way, he lol refused to keep that promise if Sonny keeps antagonizing Carly. Jason S protective side will only further fuel Sonny S rage and his belief that Carly S bond with Jason has always come first. It sounds like Jason and Sonny have a pretty fierce face off coming up, so that should lead to some tense scenes. Will Jason end up wondering if Sonny S lying about taking his meds the more unhinged Sonny S behavior becomes, the more Jason may be convinced something isnt right. General Hospital spoilers say Sonny will keep acting like he s fine since he s indeed taking his pills and doesn't he understand that anything s wrong. Our predictions point to this altered medication situation leading to serious trouble, so stay tuned for updates on all the stunning news ahead, title, Clash of Titans, Jason slams Sonny for mean streak finally fights back over Carly. In the heart of Port Charles, where emotions run as deep as the currents of the sea, tensions simmer beneath the surface, ready to erupt like a volcanic eruption. General Hospital's most formidable figures, Jason Morgan and Sonny Corinthos, stand on the precipice of a confrontation years in the making. For decades, their bond has been unbreakable, forged in the fires of loyalty and brotherhood. But lately, Cracks have begun to fissure through their once solid foundation, threatening to shatter everything they hold dear. It all began with a woman Carly Corinthos, the fiery queen of Port Charles whose presence ignites passion and chaos in equal measure. For years, Jason has stood by Carly's side, a silent guardian watching over her through every storm. But lately, Sonny's possessive grip on Carly has tightened leaving Jason to watch helplessly as his best friend slips further away. The tension between the two men reaches a boiling point when Jason witnesses Sonny's mean streak firsthand. A simple disagreement escalates into a heated argument, with harsh words exchanged like daggers in the dimly lit room. Jason, usually the epitome of calm and restraint, can no longer contain his simmering rage. Enough, Sonny. Jason's voice cuts through the air like a whip, sharp and unforgiving. His eyes blaze with a fire that matches the fury in his words. You can't keep treating Carly like she's your possession. She deserves better than this. Sonny, accustomed to being the one in control, bristles at Jason's defiance. His jaw clenches, his dark eyes narrowing into slits of anger. And who are you to tell me how to handle my wife he retorts, 
his voice a low growl that rumbles through the room. I'm the one who's been there for her when you couldn't be, Jason counters, his tone dripping with bitterness. I've watched her suffer at your hands, Sonny. I won't stand by and let it happen anymore. The tension between them crackles like electricity, the air thick with the weight of unspoken truths and unresolved conflicts. It's a battle of wills, a clash of titans who once stood shoulder to shoulder but now find themselves on opposite sides of a divide that threatens to consume them both. With a primal roar, Sonny lunges forward, his fists clenched in fury. But Jason is ready, his reflexes honed to a razor's edge after years of surviving in a world where danger lurks around every corner. He meets Sonny blow for blow, each strike a testament to the bond that once bound them together. The fight spills out into the dimly lit alley behind the metro court, the sounds of their struggle echoing off the brick walls like a symphony of violence. Blood mixes with sweat as they trade blows, neither willing to back down until one of them emerges victorious. But as the dust settles and the adrenaline fades, what remains is the harsh reality of a friendship fractured beyond repair. Jason stands alone in the cold embrace of the night, his heart heavy with the weight of what has been lost. Meanwhile, Sonny retreats into the shadows, his pride wounded and his spirit bruised. He knows that things will never be the same between them, that the rift that now divides them is too deep to bridge. And as the dawn breaks over Port Charles, casting its golden light upon a city still reeling from the aftermath of their clash, one thing becomes painfully clear, Jason and Sonny may have fought over Carly, but in the end, it was their own demons that tore them apart. Title, General Hospital Spoilers Jason slams Sonny for mean streak finally fights back over Carly. In the pulsating heart of Port Charles, emotions flare like wildfire, burning bridges and igniting long-standing feuds. In the latest twist of fate, General Hospital witnesses a seismic shift as Jason Morgan, the silent sentinel of Sonny Corinthos Empire, finally confronts his lifelong friend over a betrayal that cuts deeper than any blade. The air in the dimly lit warehouse hangs heavy with tension, thick with the weight of unspoken words. Jason stands, a stoic figure cloaked in shadows, his gaze hardened with resolve. Across from him, Sonny looms like a titan, his features etched with a mixture of defiance and regret. Jason, Sonny's voice rumbles through the silence, the word laden with a history of camaraderie and loyalty. But beneath the surface lies a simmering undercurrent of tension, a fracture in their bond that threatens to rupture irreparably. Jason's jaw clenches, the muscles rippling beneath his skin as he squares his shoulders, preparing for the battle ahead. Sonny, he replies, his tone devoid of the warmth that once defined their relationship. The confrontation hangs in the air like a charged storm waiting to unleash its fury upon the unsuspecting landscape of Port Charles. For too long, Jason has stood in the shadow of Sonny's dominance, a silent enforcer bound by unspoken vows of loyalty. But now, the time for silence has passed, replaced by a burning desire to reclaim his autonomy and protect the woman who holds his heart. Enough, Sonny, Jason's voice cuts through the tension like a knife sharp and unwavering. I won't stand by and watch you destroy everything we've built. Sonny's brow furrows, confusion flickering across his features like a passing storm. What are you talking about, Jason I've always had our best interests at heart. But Jason refuses to be swayed by empty promises and hollow justifications. With a swift movement, he steps forward closing the distance between them with determined purpose. You've crossed a line, Sonny. Carly deserves better than this. The mention of Carly's name hangs between them like a fragile thread, tethering them to a shared history that spans decades. But now, that history threatens to unravel in the face of betrayal and deceit. Sonny's eyes narrow, his expression hardening with defiance. Carly is my wife. Jason. I'll do whatever it takes to protect her. 
A bitter laugh escapes Jason's lips, the sound echoing off the cold, concrete walls of the warehouse. Protect her is that what you call it using her as leverage in your power games? The accusation strikes Sonny like a physical blow, his mask of indifference crumbling in the face of Jason's unwavering gaze. I never meant to hurt her, Jason. You have to believe me. But belief is a fragile thing, easily shattered by the weight of betrayal and broken promises. And in that moment, Jason's faith in his lifelong friend hangs by a thread, stretched to its breaking point by the weight of undeniable truth. I can't do this anymore, Sonny, Jason's voice is barely a whisper, the words heavy with resignation. I won't stand by and watch you destroy everything we've worked for. With those final words, Jason turns on his heel, his footsteps echoing through the empty warehouse as he strides away from the man who was once his closest confidant. Behind him, Sonny stands alone, his world crumbling around him as he grapples with the consequences of his actions. In the wake of their confrontation, the landscape of Port Charles is forever altered, irrevocably changed by the fracture in their once unbreakable bond. And as the dust settles, a new chapter begins, one defined by betrayal, redemption and the unyielding power of love.